Washington, Republican candidates and conservative activists are planning to attack President Joe Biden's COVID vaccine mandates in court and on the campaign trail, but they face uphill battles in trying to block the plan. Conservatives in the House Freedom Caucus on Friday denounced Biden's plan as another attempt by the Biden regime to expand its control over Americans' daily lives, according to a statement issued by the group's chairman, Rep. Andy Biggs, Republican Arizona Biden on Thursday announced a number of stringent VAC. Polls show vaccine mandates are popular with voters and a string of court rulings give the federal government the authority to impose them in certain cases. Biden, citing voter support for vaccine mandates and saying they are necessary to defeat the COVID pandemic, professed a lack of worry about the GOP's legal and political threats. Have at it, Biden told reporters. The intense political debate over vaccines emerges in the run-up to the 2022 congressional and gubernatorial elections, and even the 2024 presidential race. In announcing his plan, Biden criticized elected officials actively working to undermine the fight against COVID-19, an apparent reference to Republican governors like Ron DeSantis of Florida and Greg Abbott of Texas. DeSantis and Abbott responded that they would oppose Biden's call to impose vaccinations on Americans, saying the choice should be up to individuals rather than government. How could we get to the point in this country where you would want to have someone lose their job because of their choice about? Abbott called the Biden plan an assault on private businesses, and said he has issued an executive order protecting Texans' right to choose whether they get the COVID vaccine. Texas is already working to halt this power grab, Abbott tweeted. DeSantis and Abbott said they have been vaccinated and both face re-election bids next year, and are said to be considering presidential runs in 2024. Biden's proposal requires vaccinations for federal employees and contractors as well as health care workers. Biden said his plan would affect 100 million people, about two-thirds of all workers. In announcing his plan on Thursday, Biden said the vaccination issue is not about freedom or personal choice, but protecting public health in the midst of an unprecedented pandemic. It's about protecting yourself and those around you, Biden said.